Welcome to Nodality 1.4. Nodality is a unique node-based image editor and processor for iPads. Images, filters, parameter values are all represented as nodes in a network. Let's look at using Nodality for compositing some images together. To create a, to import an image, I long hold on the background, say that new node is an image loader, then browse my camera roll. I can import another image. Image loader, browse, I'll pull in a second image, and then to composite those together, all I do is create a further node, say that's an image filter of type composite, long hold on the node to go into relationship creation mode, pick my target, same again, and now we have two images comp together. I can change the compositing method by clicking these buttons. And I can also rotate my source files by pressing this button. And now you can see we have the two images comp together. A double click here shows me a full size preview. I can actually apply filters to the output of this comp. If I create a new node here, of type filter, and a filter there, say that's a bloom filter, plug that into the bloom, maybe another one where I want to adjust the white point. Adjust, white point, take the output, plug it into the white point filter. Now the white point expects an RGB value. So if I create another new node, of type operator, RGB, plug that into the white point, and then pick a number, let's say 0.8, plug that into the red and green channels, to give that image a yellow tint. We can actually take the output of these two generated nodes and plug them into a further composite. Image filter, composite, difference, plug that into image one, plug that into image two. At any time I can go back and start editing my nodes. So for instance, I can come in here and plug in a value into that bloom, let's say 12 and 8, plug those into the value and the radius, zoom back out, zoom back into my area of interest, and there's no reason why I can't carry on creating new nodes and plugging in the output from each one, so I can get a Gaussian blur, image filter, off type filter, Gaussian blur, Take the output of our difference, plug it into there, zoom back out, and maybe take that 12 and use that as the input or the value of our Gaussian blur. You can even go a step further, take the output of these two and comp those together. Image filter, composite, difference, I can go back in time as well and then change parameters on the original images. I can rotate them round. You can see how that permeates through the whole network. Or I can change it from fill to fit, make them both fit. Zoom back into my area of interest, click on this, take a closer look. If I fancy, I can actually save that back out to my camera roll. And there we have a quick introduction to compositing and filtering in Nodality 1.4. Thank you.